it. Come on, we have to go. I'll be there in a second. No, now we have to do our daily morning stretches. Hello, campers. Do 50 push-ups by 7 or no breakfast. <laughs> what? You read the title. You know what we're going to be talking about. But what is a camp? A place with temporary accommodations of huts, tents, or other structures, typically used by soldiers, refugees, prisoners, or travelers. There's not much to say, so... Camp stories. Wait, my arm. As I don't have an arm anymore. So, I got dropped off at camp, uh, for this video, Camp Spy. Anyways, I found a tiny cabin, and it was pretty cool. One of the camp leaders had a Lego clock minifigure, and I wanted that thing more than a basic girl wants Starbucks. <laughs> Bro has humor from 2012. I swear I will eat you. So there I was, looking at my bunk, obviously choosing the top one because I ain't no lower class person. Duh. And I was up there for a whole three minutes before I had to go to the so-called main house. There, we learned about Jesus and the Bible and stuff. You know. But. You were there for a different reason. For some reason, the camp leaders decided to make a cool little, little rules video for all of us. So that was cool. Alright. One thing that makes our camp really cool is that we have a pool. Yes, I'm lucky. But this story says the opposite. At our camp, we had to do a swim test. You have to do it if you want to go in the deep end. What you have to do is swim from one side to the other. Easy, right? <laughs> so I do it, and I get to one side. When I try to go to the other side, this girl apparently can't look both ways while crossing. Because she just spawned right in front of me. She didn't even stop like I would have. So obviously this catches me off guard. And to avoid hitting a girl, I had to stop and retry the swim test. I tried again and again and again and again and again, but I still couldn't pass it because people kept calling me off. Like, come on, man. So the lifeguard told me that I had to stay in the kiddie pool. Last video, at the part where I talk about New Super Mario Brothers, I wore a Spider-Man mask that I wore in the dark. But what happens when a guy brings a Spider-Man mask and sees a tall thing that people claim for fun? Dog, should I like save him or something? I'm just kidding. That didn't happen. They actually lowered me down very lamely, so I wasn't actually Spider-Man. I was scared, man. <laughs> Subscribe right now. One of the rules at camp is no technology. And literally everybody follows that rule. Even if it wasn't a rule, we would just know not to bring him. Except for the camp leaders, apparently. Because after one tiring day, we had a movie night. You already used the screen background three times. Stop being so Anyways, 
We all got our sleeping bags and watched The Incredibles. After the movie, when I mean over, I mean go back to our cabins when it was 75% in the movie. Which I thought was pretty weird. But because I'm so smart and so funny, I decided that I would put my sleeping bag over my head. And try not to smack into somebody. But it was actually quite easy. I got there in like 30 seconds. I mean, the bunks were in place. It, it had to be my cabin, right? So I was just trying to find which one it was my bunk, but then I heard, Dude, this is cabin six. And I was thinking, uh, uh, Wait, what? Wrong one. So it was actually in a cabin that was a completely different number. And my cabin was the one right next to it. At least it wasn't a girl's cabin. Guys, I finished the video. <laughs> this video took me so long. I'm so happy it's finally done. It's been two months and I finally did it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Who am I thinking again? Uh, you got Actually, though, this is like the biggest thing I've done on this channel so far. I've tried a bunch of new stuff and it ended up so good. It would be great if you subscribed. There's this like pixelated me, you know, if you see that in the video, put it in the comments. But yeah, I hid it in the video somewhere. I'm 100% doing a part two because I recently went to the camp again. So I have a bunch of new stuff to talk about. Got this new mic, so it's gonna make it sound better. If you can tell, it sounds a bit better. But now that I think about it, seven is seven minutes is pretty good for a channel like mine. Yeah. Subscribe.